today I decided to create an eye tutorial for you. Spring is already here, I'm obviously craving color, and this is how I came up with this look today. Do remember that if you don't own the products that I'm going to use today, you can simply replace them for products that you already own. Without any delays though, let's jump into the tutorial. Hey there! In today's tutorial, my goal is to try to be a little bit chattier, so as I am applying my makeup, I'm going to tell you a thing or two about me. Hopefully you like that and if you have any questions, just let me know. Let's jump into the eye tutorial and we are going to start by applying the color Chickadee by Makeup Geek. I am going to take a fluffy blending brush and I will be applying this color all around my crease. Let me start by telling you that my name is Fabiola. Most people do call me Fabi. It depends on who the person is. To my parents, I am flaca. Para mis papás, para mis padres, soy flaca. Me han llamado así desde chiquita. And to my sisters, I am simply sister. Sometimes I am a pain in their behind and Sometimes we're pretty chill with each other. I love my sisters. If you ask me who my best friends are, it's them. I don't think I've ever felt the need to look for friends because I've always felt like I've had sisters. And to me, family comes first. Once you feel satisfied with your blending on both ends, on both eyes, then you move on to the next color. Now I am going to be applying the color Mango Tango by Makeup Geek and I am taking a smaller blending brush. I'm trying to think about things to tell you about me but really I don't know, I don't feel like there's much to me. I was just a big, I was a big nerd in high school. I did go to college. This is definitely not my area of expertise and I've mentioned it before. I did acquire a four year degree, but my field, it's, it's not makeup. This is truly my hobby and when I say it, I mean it. I do have a full-time job and I love my job. I love doing what I do on an everyday basis. Now with my fluffy blending brush, I'm just going to go over everything just to make sure it's all blended. I am not adding any additional color. A very important fact about me is that I do have two kids. I am happily married. I've been married for five years. And my husband is my high school sweetheart. We are not perfect, but we work through everything because we really, really love each other. For my lid shade, I will be using a highlighter. It is a wet and wild highlight in Boozy Brunch. And this is a highlight color right here. I am going to be taking this flat brush and I'm going to apply this color all over my eyelid. Of course, before I do that, I will be applying makeup setting spray to the brush so that it can intensify the highlight that much more. Mango Tango comes back into the picture, we are going to apply this color. I'm simply going to take the brush that I was using for my lid since I am going to apply this on my lid as well on top of the outer corner of my eye. So I'm going to simply apply it with the same brush. I'm going to take 
some of the color and again I'm going to apply it from the outer corner and I'm going to slowly blend it in. I am extremely horrible when it comes to conversation. So the lesson of today's story is that if you want to know something about me, you need to ask because again, I'm, I'm here trying to figure out what to say next and nothing's popping onto my brain except let's blend this makeup. With the smaller blending brush, I am going to be marrying my lid shade with my crease and everything else going on in the top. I did apply the color Mango Tango. So again, let's start blending. Again, Mango Tango is going to go on this smaller flat brush and I'm going to go over the color that I've already applied on the outer corner of my eye. I'm simply going to make sure that the color is intense enough. For one of our final steps, I am going to apply the color Cherry Cola just on the outer edge on top of my crease on a very precise area. I'm going to do this to just add a little bit of color on that outer edge. But not least, I will be applying the color Chickity once again. And I'm going to apply it with a fluffy brush. I'm going to start on the outer corner. And I'm just going to make sure that everything is very well blended. Now with this flat brush, I am going to be applying Mango Tango just very close to my lower lash line. I hope you like this pinky, corally tutorial. I, I don't know, I just decided to do something different, something pink, because spring is already here and I'm starting to think color. With this $1 pencil brush, I am going to be applying the color Chickity. I'm just going to make sure that everything underneath my lower lash line is blended. When it comes to the look, so far this is what we have. Hold on one second, I'll be back in a flash. I am going to be applying the rest of my makeup off camera. We've come to the end of this video. Hopefully you found it helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Leave your request on the comments down below and ask any questions. If you feel curious about me, just let me know. Ask me the question and I'll probably discuss it on the next video. Remember, as we saw, I clearly have a little trouble getting chatty, so help me out here ask me questions. Anyhow, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Hit that bell button for notifications, and hopefully I see you here next time. Goodbye.